played our ass off the whole night. We had some stretches where we didn't do so well, um, but I thought we defended when we needed to, uh, especially if we started the game. We closed the game as well. And um, speaking of that, your coach just said that you deserve a lot more credit than you get for your defense, and, and specifically tonight with the way you defended Steph Curry. Uh, what was your approach against him tonight? And do you agree with, with Scott that you, you feel like you should get more credit for your defense? You know what? I, I definitely, I mean, I like I said, I feel like I'm a player that uh, can do it all, defend, score, whatever it is that needs to be done. My job changes every night, and I feel like I'm one of, one of the, those players that if I need to defend at a high level, I can do that too. If I need to score at a high level, I can do that. Pass, I can do that. Rebound, I can do that. Woman to coach, shit, I can do that too. You know, uh, you know, I just feel like I can do everything, and that's uh, been blessed to be able to play the game. And tonight, um, yeah, I, t I definitely took pride in, in defending and making sure that uh, you know Steph's been on a hot streak. Um, he's been playing very well, and I, I took the challenge um, to start the game and make sure that you know he can see his streak on us tonight. Ava, Russ, you had a couple of fans with a welcome Russell Westbrook banner in the corner there. What was it like your first game in front of uh, fans here in DC? I was great, man. The fans are uh, amazing, good energy. I know they were excited to kind of just get get into the arena and watching basketball. Uh, so happy that we were able to, to to bring home the victory. I look forward to some more home games and uh, you know getting more people in the arena and getting the fans more excited, excited about the things uh, in the near future for us. And we've asked Scott this, but with this stretch going so well for you guys, eight of the last nine, do you feel like this team can still improve? Where do you feel like the ceiling is for this group? Uh, we just take one game at a time. It's part of my job as a leader to make sure that our guys in the locker room understand we take one game at a time. We can't look too far ahead, look back at the game. This game is over tonight. It's over. Uh, now we got to get our minds and ready for, for Oklahoma coming up, and uh, that's all we can worry about. DA. Uh, Russ, you, you've you've been on teams that kind of were already in the playoffs at this point in the season. <laughs> um, but what is the line on to take it back to maybe your first couple of years in OKC when you guys were young and you were just starting to what what happens when a team really starts to believe in itself and starts to think that it, it really is as good as as people outside say they are, and, and maybe it all comes together. I uh, mean, it's a, it's a great thing. You know, I, I believe in confidence, um, instilling confidence in other people, um, instilling, making them feel great about themselves, their game. Um, and when the collectively as a team, you feel like you can do anything, um, anything's possible. And I really believe that. Um, and I always have uh, since I got in the league, regardless of kind of the situation, you always uh, want to be confident regardless of what's happening and keep your mind in a positive way. And just tonight, what what were you guys able to do to kind of turn Poole's water off and tune, tune uh, Ubre's water off a little bit down the stretch? Uh, be more physical, uh, be more physical, lock in a little bit, made them shoot tougher shots. They were getting some easy looks, um, some dunks, and easy wide open threes. Uh, you know, they're good players and uh, did a good job of locking in defensively, especially for the last five minutes. Yeah. Fred. Hey, Russell. Um, with Denny's injury tonight, I'm, I'm just wondering from your perspective, what, what has he been like for you guys off the court? What's his locker room presence been like? What's, what's your personal relationship like with him? Uh, Denny's been amazing. You know, he's been great. And what, and what was your reaction just to seeing him, you know, a young guy in his first year go down like that? Uh, my first reaction um, is to pray for him, uh, to pray for him and his mental wellness, um, because that's it's going to get him through these tough times. And uh, our job is to make sure we support him. Matt. Hey, Russ. Uh, Scott was saying that, you know, your experience really helps late in games. And I was just wondering, as a guy who's been in a lot of big games, how do you think it kind of helped weather the storm in this one and helped pull it out? Well, you know, I take pride in clutch moments. Um, I take pride in, in, in making the right plays down the stretch. I take pride in the last five minutes of games, um, making big shots, making big plays. Um, and that's something that I've done, you know, and, in my career. But go ahead, Matt. Oh, yeah. Um, you actually lead the NBA in clutch uh, field goal percentage in, in the oh, last five minutes. Really? Yeah. Ah, that's interesting. That's interesting. <laughs> I didn't uh, know that. Yeah. Um, just so, what do you make of that? 
Oh, I know what I do. I ain't worried about what <laughs> nobody else thinking. <laughs> That's one thing about me. It doesn't really matter what nobody else thinks, you know, but it's okay. You know, just keep doing what I'm doing. Keep my head straight and just keep hoping. That's all I can do. Thanks. Thanks, man. And last question to Christos. Hello, Rush. Congratulations on the win. What do you like most on the way that you respond in the last uh, f last six minutes of the game? Um, I like the way we uh, came together. Uh, we didn't put our head down. It just shows the, the growth of our team from the start of the season till now. Uh, Earlier in the season, we kind of we lost this game. Uh, but tonight, we stuck together. We fought. Uh, we got stops on demand, uh, which is very important in this league to get um, and rebound the basketball and obviously made plays.